telling people to mind their business on social media is so ridiculous it, it actually makes me laugh the social media feud between popular actress Nkechi Blessing Sunday and self-acclaimed relationship expert Blessing CEO is escalating. The argument began on November 25, 2023 after Blessing CEO posted pictures to show off a new Bible page tattoo and banging body. A show off moved to make a statement. Sadly, it backfired and caught the reaction of Nkechi Blessing and other celebs who body shamed her. Nkechi Blessing Sunday, however, went as far as calling her a placard. The situation, as you can imagine, escalated. In only a matter of time, Blessing CEO and Nkechi were locked in a battle of supremacy as they debated who had more houses and cars and who was wealthier. When we thought we had seen it all, the pair have now taken their beef to the streets and pinned to touch grass. In a viral video, Nkechi visited Blessing CEO's workplace and was heard urging the relationship experts to come out so that they could trash their beef using their fists. Pick a date and venue, I go deflate your nyash. She hollered. Hmm. Would Blessing CEO take on the challenge? <laughs> oh my goodness. Blessing on your zeal. You can lie, you. Hello, guys. It's Tiko here for African Glitz. Self proclaimed relationship expert Blessing Inkiruka Okoro, also known as Blessing CEO, wasn't always a top influencer. A few years ago, the entrepreneur gathered some money and decided to enhance her body. Sadly, the content creator's skin was covered with scars after the transformation. After much dragging online when she displayed her body in raunchy outfits, the celebrated commentator got a tattoo artist to perform magic and voila, months later, the bikini body was ready for flaunting. The branded queen of clouds decided to show off via her Instagram page and shared both clips and photos of her rocking a two-piece crochet bikini as she took a catwalk while relaxing by the poolside. The mother of two's main intention was to show off a latest tattoo, an open Bible with two verses, one from Matthew 11, 12 and Proverbs 31. In the comments, Blessing bragged that it's pool day and her body is the temple of the holy. But many people didn't seem pleased by what they described as a gory sight. Don't you have genuine friends? People asked while expressing disgust. Joining the body shaming, famous Yoruba actress Nkechi Blessing dragged her namesake to filth, describing her as a placard. Bikini no be for everybody, sha. At least, I de respect myself with my big belly. <laughs> now, see as auntie be like placard where they use for protest. Ashiri da, she wrote. Further describing her as mad, Nkechi urged fans to tag Blessing CU on the post because she could not find the correct handle. I beg, Taga, cause I know if it find the wire handle. She wrote. Initially, Blessing CEO refrained from reacting, claiming maturity is problematic when dealing with a failed actress constantly jumping from one relationship to another. Further peppering haters, Blessing CEO dropped a photo of her body before she underwent cosmetic surgery. Bikini body before liposuction and BBL. Mother of two memory lane. She wrote. Firing back at Blessing CEO, the Nollywood star corrected her and said she is not an actress but a successful realtor with over 10,000 acres of land to her name. Inkeru Kaokoro Blessing CEO I no be actress, dear. I'm a real estate mogul with over 10,000 acres of land to my name. Maybe I'm not updated. CEO of over 5 successful businesses, almost 3 years off the screens and I still stand strong. You should know I'm the last person to drag. We go gather Chris, my dear. So remove that cello tape from your mouth and set your ring light. Let us begin, she wrote. In the following clip, Nketi asked how Blessing CEO attracts clients for relationship advice when she has two failed marriages. So matter starts, the only thing that you've been talking about is relationship this, relationship that, blah, blah, blue. It is very obvious and even very obvious to the blind that Yes, you never come in a long while. And I know, I know, I get that feeling. By the time woman never really pour water for body, you'd always be like, say, one wrong. <laughs> My darling, at least if to say I'm married woman, they follow me talk now. We'll say, okay, what's him, what's him differentiate me and you? You don't have anybody in your life that loves you, no worry. That rubber away, you carry for you. A leak. Uche Madua will say, when una day caught, say the thing they drop water and was smelling all over the place. Darling, you've got absolutely nothing on me. Trust me, nothing, baby. 
I'd rather be in a relationship and when I'm tired and moved and be in two failed marriages. God forbid. And when I'm married, I'll be married right. Even though a rich make a rich 40 years or 45, you're not concerned, you're not a catch late comma. Choosing not to be the biggest person anymore, Blessing CEO finally fired back. The relationship grew to a swipe at the actress over her love for dating younger men. A lot of people are waiting for me to reply that young girl with confused identity and name. That young girl where they pick small boys every AK market. I know one send her because I just did outside like public toilet. She lamented. Blessing CEO alleged that she met in Kechi at an event twice and her energy online is nothing but fake. She is not relevant. That's why even Insta blog no remember her. I don't meet her two times for events. One event in Delta State and one in Lagos. I be one change and for her in Delta State. Now she can't meet me, tell me, say, eh, social media no be real life. That's my anger. They don't keep the same energy in real life. In Kechi Blessing Sunday, na noisemaker. She explained, Nkechi Blessing was so pained that hours after her namesake put her on a blast, she visited CEO's office in person, spoiling for a physical fight. Sharing this video of herself outside the relationship expert office in Lekki, the actress asked Blessing CEO to show her face so they could settle things with their fist since words alone are not enough. Blessing Chief EO, I am in front of your lounge. Like I said before, if you know say your mama and your papa, they do name in ceremony for you when they born you. Come outside your therapy lounge. I will pause this video and I will wait for 30 minutes. I am outside. I will, after you see this video, or then send you this video, I'm here 30 more minutes. Now me alone, come oh. I no come with anybody. Oh. If you don't say they do name ceremony for you when they born you, come outside your lounge. I don't want to talk too much. We don't they go back and forth too much for Instagram because they be like small picking team at 34. You come outside your lounge so that we go trash and once and for all so everybody go rest. Blessing CEO immediately reacted after she watched the clip and slammed the Nollywood actress for coming to her office on a Sunday. She further lamented that Nkechi Blessing's visit to her office was filled by hate and jealousy and wondered why Nkechi Blessing would visit her office on Sunday night when she was not an armed robber. The relationship therapist further exposed photos of all the men Nkechi allegedly dated over the past year. With a note of finality, Blessing CEO dared a namesake to visit her workspace during the day, promising that her security would rough handle her, followed by her PA and then the police. Well, well, since the self-styled relationship experts made this bogus threat, we haven't heard a word from Inkechi Blessing Sunday or seen her come close to her rival's workplace. Does this mean she is no longer interested in touching grass? We guess time will tell. On the other hand, Nigerians have been reacting wildly to the social media drama between the two controversial figures. Reacting on Instagram, one user wrote, Just two jobless women that are not facing economic crisis. Make nobody separate in our fight, oh. Another wrote, <laughs> Bless to see you is such a funny nuisance. I came across those her videos dragging in Kechi Blessing Sunday. I started laughing instead of getting angry. I've never seen anyone as troublesome as she is. Also reacting, a user wrote, In Kechi Blessing, calling Blessing CEO a thief for claiming a house he didn't build. Meanwhile, you said don't claim man when no marry you. Now, nah, one rope tie on I shall they support CEO. Also reacting, one user concluded, if you're not related to any of these two, you don't know what Abba Father has done for you. Hmm. What do you think about Nkechi Blessing Sunday calling Blessing CEO a placard? Do you think the actress did that because the self-acclaimed relationship expert ignored her at events? Or are they just chasing clout to improve their online visibility? Finally, 
Do you think Inkechi Blessing will challenge Blessing CEO further or visit our office for a physical version of their cyber Share your opinion in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified every time I upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.